Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So, uh, I think I told you in my last On the Table that I wanted to kind of work on my mind's uh, layout so that I could incorporate this piece into the complete minds. And if you haven't seen my minds, uh, I have a video it's called The Minds of Ham. And I think it's I think it's in one of my playlists with uh, Terrain Projects. So if you take a look at it, you will see the mines that I built. But what we are going to do today is I've recently picked up this uh, Terrain Crate Abandoned Mines by Mantic Games. This is pretty old. It's been out a while. Uh, but I'm just, I just want to see what it looks like and kind of give you some ideals of how we can incorporate this into a mine layout here that's going to feature our king on the granite throne. Uh, yeah, I'm, I was not a big fan of Terrain Crate when it came out. I think over the years since it's been out, I've probably picked up maybe three of the six or seven Terrain Crate offerings that they made. Mostly the books and library and now this, pretty much. That's about it. They had other stuff like a throne room and treasure chest, which, you know, I could make those on my own. So we can see here some of the pieces have kind of come out from their locations. So we will start with these mine tracks, which look somewhat tiny for a mine car. Because, I mean, they look a lot bigger on the... Uh, packaging these are almost actual size here so but they look bigger on there but these are not they're not that big if you can see them so we get we get several of these pieces it doesn't look like they connect I mean you can press them together but there's there's nothing that actually connects them uh, which I mean I guess that's not a big thing Let's take a look here. We get two of these mine cars with control levers. These are pretty solid. There's no bending or warping. So I like those. This is some more tracks. These are some straight sections that we could lay out. So I wish they had had some that were already longer. This is this might be a little a bit of a hassle trying to paint all these little bitty pieces. Then we have a couple of these kind of mined equipment, picks and axes and other looks like lanterns or lights. So that'll be nice. And I mean, pretty much, we're kind of done with the pack. Oh wait, here we go. Let's see what this is. So. These are your smaller bits. I'm not exactly sure if you can see these. But, uh, so these are some types of crystals. This looks like a, it's either an improvised keg of some sort or maybe some oil, lantern oil. You have a few picks. I guess this is gold or ore. You know, another kick. Some more of those uh, gems. These are, I think these go in the coal carts or the mine carts. So you can see how they fit in there. You got to take that out to paint it though. But that's that's nice. And then these are, I don't know, or look like they're stops for the tracks. So for the mine tracks, you have some stops. And I showed you that. And that is the entire kit. Now this kit runs about $30. I mean, if you get it on sale or at a good price, you can get it for about $24. Uh, is it worth $30? Pr 
Probably not. Uh, these tracks are pretty rubbery. I mean, they're not... I'm not worried about them breaking or anything, but they're not really... They're not hard. Like I said, they don't connect, which that is... That's kind of a bummer. Because it would have been nice if I could have at least connected them. And then, uh, you know had a layout which you could use over several types of pieces as it is I mean you're gonna have to lay each piece down or you're gonna have to glue them down to some kind of separate base I mean I thought this this is probably to me worth about 15 bucks but you know I needed it and you know I could have tried to wait and piece out the resin pieces individually twisting catacombs has kind of the same mine items which you could probably get most of them and about as much stuff for thirty dollars with them but it would i'd have to wait six weeks for it to get here from overseas or wherever so that is the abandoned mines by mantic games hope you enjoyed that take care